Welcome everyone to a new video on Cake Defy. In this two part series, we're gonna start today with liquidity mining and why I think it's actually the one that has the least risk. It's super simple. I'm gonna walk you through step by step and let's get started. What we want to do today is provide liquidity and get rewards for it. And the liquidity pair that we're gonna use is USDT and DUSD. And if you're wondering why this pair, because the yield on this one is quite high. They are both stable coins. One is USDT, you probably know, and the other is an algorithmic stable coin. And the yield is around 13 to 15%. And another thing you might ask, like algorithmic stable coins, aren't those like super risky and they can lose in value quite a lot. And if you look at DUSD, it trades at around 50 cents so what happened there and i agree i wouldn't invest into or i wouldn't hold an algorithmic stable coin but here's the thing what we're going to do differently is we borrow this stable coin and therefore the price of the stable coin actually doesn't really matter because um, if we have enough collateral we're gonna borrow the dosd and uh, once we're done with liquidity mining we repay the dosd and get our collateral back that doesn't depend on the price of the USD. It could be 50 cents, it could be 70 cents. It doesn't really matter because we're just paying it back and get our collateral back instead. So the next step we have to do is download the app because it's not available on desktop yet. And let me show you what that looks like on my phone. We hit bake and then we scroll down until we see borrow. And what's important here that if you want to borrow, you need 50% in DFI token and the rest can be stable coins, Bitcoin, but 50% of the collateral needs to be in DFI tokens. That's really the only risk. You have to make sure that you don't get liquidated. So have at least, they say like you need 200%, but I would put more, I would put 300, maybe even 400% to make sure um, in case like we, we see a drop in the market. Okay, so now that we borrowed DUSD, we head over to liquidity mining and we can add DUSD and USDT here. And you can see that the yield is around 13%. So that's pretty good. I also like about this because they're both stable coins and the price doesn't range that much. For example, with other liquidity pairs, you have the risk of impairment loss when the price um, fluctuates a lot. And I would say with DUSD and USDT, you don't really have that. I think it's safer like to do this with stable coins. And especially if you borrowed the USD, you also don't have to worry about the price of the USD. And yeah, USDT, I will think is most likely to hold um, its peg. So we don't have to worry about that either. And here you can see my small liquidity mining position. So that will earn around 13%. And I think, yeah, the risk is, is pretty low, but make sure that you don't get liquidated. So have at least 300% in a collateral. I think then you're pretty safe and of course watch the crypto market and in case your percentage drops then add more collateral just to make sure you don't get liquidated. In the next video I have another method how you can use DUSD to earn a good yield on Cactify. That might be even better. I'm not quite sure yet. I have to see uh, how much money it's going to earn. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty excited about that and I will show you this in the next video tomorrow So stay tuned for that and I will see you in the next video